Hey guys, it's your girl Miss Shake coming at you with a quick collective beauty haul. These are the items I picked up over the last month and a half, two months possibly. So to jump into it real quick, the first thing I picked up from the MAC permanent line is the eyeshadow and brown script in the pan form. It's a matte squared finish. This is my favorite finish out of all the matte finish, MAC finishes. I also picked up Fig One. It's a nice pretty purple. And it's also a matte square finish. Then, from the Posh Paradise collection, I picked up five of the matte teen lipsticks. I owned one from the Style Black collection, Night Violet. It's such a pretty dark purple, so I kind of went crazy in this collection. The first one is Legendary. It's a pretty brown color. I haven't worn that one yet. Then Eden Rouge. It's a really nice red. I haven't worn this one as either yet. I've been sticking to three of them so far. Then, Deliciously Forbidden. It's like a muted pinky mauve color. Then, Potent Fig. This is like the darkest purple ever. Not as dark as Night Violet, but such a pretty dark purple. And I have pictures on my blog wearing it. So if you check it out, I'll put a link to one of the face of the days with it. And then Rare Exotic. It's such a really pretty bright pink. This is like my favorite one to wear to work. And my managers love it. And then from the fall color collection, I believe it's from, I picked up the pigment in em Emerald Dusk. Like a dark tealy gray, tealy green, I should say. I've worn this in the face of the day as well. It's so pretty on. I picked up the Fuel Line in Ash Violet. It's a really nice purple. I haven't used it yet, though, because I fully forgot I had it until just now. Then, I picked up Fusion Pink, which is a pro color. Ooh, that got bright. Then, Plum Bright, which I'm currently wearing. It's another pretty purple. Then, for drugstore makeup, I picked up three of the L'Oreal... Color Reach lip glosses in the tubes. I only have two on me because I don't know where the other one is. But this one is in Saucy Mauve and Mystic Mauve. I picked up two of the Remmel London Moisture Renew lipsticks. This one is Vintage Pink. It's a really nice nude pink color not too pink and not too brown almost like a mauve color I can't wait to wear that and I also picked up Nude Delight and it's oh gosh and it's that color right there that's pretty true to color then I picked up one of the new Maybelline Eye Studio palettes in Caffeine Rush. I haven't had a chance to use this yet. It's a really nude neutral palette. Then I picked up a Remmel Glam Eyes Quad in Smoky Brown. It's another neutral look. Eyeshadow quad. And then for nail polished, I was on the mission 
for the last month to find these polishes. I picked up Starry Pink. Let's see if I can get it. And that's on my accent finger today. Then Blue Mosaic, right there. This is on my toes, along with the next polish, Midnight Affair. Then the last one, which I had the hardest time finding, was Facets of Fuchsia. And this is so gorgeous, like, so beautiful. Like, I'm going to put these on my nails today. Well, this one anyways. And then the last Revlon polish I picked up was Steal Her Heart. It's really nice silver, gray. And that's the other color on my nails right now. I picked up two of the Remo Pro Lasting, the Lasting Finish Pro polishes. This one, this one is hard metal. This is more of a blue tinge than the Steel Gray Steeler Heart from Revlon. Then Rags to Riches. It's a really pretty green with a, a gold duochrome. And then from the Essie's fall collection I picked up all the colors I believe very structured glamour purse case study power clutch And ladylike. And the last thing I picked up was this Quo mini nail polish remover. Yeah. And that's everything that I picked up recently, beauty wise. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.